on that. Member for Saskatoon West. Mr. Speaker, after the Liberal leader promised he'd be the pro-pot Prime Minister, Canadians are becoming increasingly concerned about the Liberals' right word, right word shift. They appointed a former police chief to handle the issue, who then encouraged police to crack down on marijuana while continuing to hand out criminal records. And now they've appointed Anne McCollin, who has called pot more dangerous than cigarettes and was even against medicinal marijuana. How can the Liberals justify sounding more law and order on pot than even the Conservatives who just voted for decriminalization? The Honourable Minister of Justice. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and, and I thank uh, Thanks for the question. Um, as we've said, our government is committed to the legalization of marijuana, strictly regulating and restricting access to marijuana with the ultimate objective to keep it out of the hands of children and keep the proceeds out of the hands of criminals. I'm looking forward working with my colleagues, the Ministers of Health and Public Safety, to in the coming weeks announcing a task force that will uh, engage uh, uh, on this issue. And the task force will be comprised of uh, representatives from the justice, uh, system, public safety, health, and uh, I look forward to the recommendations that they provide in this regard. The Honourable Member for Salaberry sur -Roy. Mr. Speaker, legalizing marijuana was a major Liberal campaign promise, but the government has just assigned the file to the former Justice Minister who previously stated her opposition to medicinal marijuana. In short, a former Chief of Police and a pot opponent are in charge of legalizing marijuana. It's like putting Colonel Saunders in charge of the hen house. Is the Prime Minister trying to torpedo his own initiative? The Honourable Minister. Minister of Justice. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Again, our government is committed to legalizing marijuana, strictly regulating marijuana, and doing this in a careful and orderly manner. I'm pleased to work with the Parliamentary Secretary. I'm pleased to work with the Ministers of Health and Public Safety. And we are very pleased to, in the coming weeks, uh, announce a task force that will look into uh, uh, the work of the legalization process, what's required, what is necessary to do it in a careful way. And there will be perspectives from health, justice, law enforcement, and public safety. The Honourable 